Hi, I'm Roger Kitson, an evaluation engineer at Linear Technology. I wanted to take a moment to introduce you to the LTC 6268 op amp. It's one of our new amplifiers with high bandwidth, low input bias current, and low input capacitance. Let's take a look. The LTC 6268 is offered in an 8 pin SOIC, a 6 pin TSOT 23, and there's also a dual version available as an 8 pin MSOP and a 3x3 10 pin leadless DFN package. I'd like to draw your attention to some features of the SOIC package that we've done especially for low bias current applications. The pinout of the SOIC was arranged so that the two input pins are isolated on a separate side of the package from the other pins. This will minimize any leakage through the package plastic. We also left pins 1 and 4 open so that they can be used for routing a guard ring around the amplifier inputs on your PCB. This will help you get the most out of our low input bias currents. Let's look at some of the key features of this part. The gain bandwidth product is 500 megahertz. The input bias current is extremely low, typically less than 3 femtoamps at room temperature, increasing to a maximum of only 4 picoamps at 125C. Equally striking is the common mode input capacitance of 0.45 picofarads. The output of this part is also very strong. It can drive a 200 ohm load directly with a short circuit current of 90 milliamps. There are many things you can do with this part, but let's look at a classic 3 op amp instrumentation buffer application. The input impedance of this circuit is very high. With an input bias current in the femtoamp range, this would be ideal for sensor buffer applications. Note that the bias current remains low even across the rail-to-rail -rail input common mold voltage. The 500 megahertz gain bandwidth product allows the single stage to have considerable gain while maintaining required system bandwidth. Such low input bias with high bandwidth can open up new application possibilities. Another good application for the LTC 6268 is transimpedance amplifiers. Here's an example of a laser-driven photodiode transimpedance circuit we set up in our lab. We offer a decompensated version of the LTC 6268 designed specifically for this kind of circuit, named the LTC 6268-10. The extended bandwidth of this version, combined with the low input capacitance of 0.45 picofarads, yields remarkable performance. Our example has a gain of 20K and shows a measured bandwidth of 225 megahertz for the decomp version. Our standard version is good for 65 megahertz in the same application. If you're looking for an amplifier with extremely low input bias current, low input capacitance, coupled with high bandwidth and a great output drive, consider the LTC 6268. For more information, please visit us at linear.com. Thanks for watching.